We'll guide you through how to use a voice changer in Roblox. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. It's important to note that you do need to have voice chat enabled on your account. But now let's go and open up a new tab. And what you need to do is go and search for clownfish voice changer, just like so. And you want to come to the official site, which is clownfish-translator.com. And then all you need to do is go and click on download at the top here. There will be ads, so just be aware of that. Now scroll down and we can go and hit on the download button like so. After it's finished downloading, open up your file explorer and come to your downloads and go and find it and double click on it to go and run it. You'll go and get a Windows Cootie pop-up, which you need to agree to. Click next and we can then go and follow the installation steps. And just like that, it's now finished installing. You can click on finish. And now what we can do is go and open up Clownfish by double clicking on it like so. After you've done that, you then need to come to the bottom right and click on the show hidden icons and go and locate Clownfish just here. You can then go and right click on it and you want to hover over setup and click on system integration. You'll go and get this pop up and what you need to do is choose the microphone you want to go and use. For me it's already installed the correct one. If it's the wrong one remove it and install the right one. And you can then close off this. Now what you can do is go into a Roblox game. Now here we are and what you need to do is pause the game. Go into settings at the top and come down to input device. And what you need to do is go and select the correct input device, which you selected in Clownfish. For me, it was this one here. And now what we can do is we can go into Clownfish. Now go into Clownfish by clicking on the show hidden icons button, right click on it and click on and click on set voice changer and you'll get this pop up and you can then go and choose the f effect you want to use. For example, I'll select helium pitch. As you can hear, it's now gone helium. And then what we can do is unmute ourselves in Roblox. And now everyone will hear us with a helium voice. Of course, you can use different voice effects and even turn it off if you want. If you found this useful, then leave a like.